Hey everybody, I'm Dieter Bone with The Verge and I'm inside a Maserati, probably the most expensive car I've ever sat in. But what I'm actually here to look at is this new system. And what Maserati and Google have done is build a concept system that shows some of the things that might be possible if a car manufacturer wanted to do a whole bunch of cool stuff. So for example here, you can see we've got a very similar basic home screen to what we've seen before. But when you start jumping into some of the apps, it goes into a split screen. So on the bottom is like the current activity, like say, you know, the Google Music you're looking at or your navigation. And then the other stuff that you're doing actually shows up on the top here. So you can jump around between the different things without having to keep hitting the home button or hitting one of these buttons on the bottom. So that's pretty cool. In addition to that, it also is an example of how Android could co directly control some of the parts of the car. So what we have here is we can control the HVAC system. So I'll turn the fan way up and there it's pretty loud. Turn it down. You can adjust the temperature on each side and you can even turn on the heated seats, which is pretty cool. Uh, there's also a smaller screen on the driver's side behind the steering wheel and it's able to show current stuff from its activity. So if you're navigating, it'll show you your next turn. When you switch to the next song, it'll slide over the album art so you can see what the, you know, the next song is. And it'll also, even when you're making a call, it'll show who you're calling for a brief bit. In your next car, which won't be a Maserati, you probably won't have this massive screen, uh, but you'll probably get a lot of these cool features and you'll get a lot of these animations and maybe you can control your, uh, your HVAC too. If you'd like to see more cool videos about Android, we're here at Google I.O. all week. Please subscribe.